Okay, so today I'm just going to quickly show you how to generate and build the AM archetype. So the first thing I've done is I've gone to repo.adobe.com and I have pasted this profile in my settings XML. Okay, and you can see that here. And then all I've done is I've switched active by default to true. And that's just so I don't have to specify Adobe Public every time I run a build. The next thing is I'm going to go to the AM Archetype GitHub repository. And I'm going to find the command to generate the archetype, which is here. I'm going to be using version 12. And then I'll just paste that. Okay, and then for the group ID, I'm just going to put my package name, like for my Java classes. And I'll just do com.adobe.training. And then for artifact ID, I'll just do training project. And there's going to be a bunch of other options here. You can just click through them. Uh, at some point, I might write a little reference on what these mean though. Okay, so that's done. I've generated my archetype. And let me just open that up in IntelliJ. And you'll see we have a few modules here. I'm just going to run through them. So core is going to be where our Java classes are going to exist. I like the Sling model, for example. IT launcher and IT tests are going to be related to integration testing. And then you have UI apps, which is going to be the stuff that generally lives under your apps folder like components and then UI content which is going to generally have your content and editable templates and this archetype will come with three different profiles so it's gonna have auto install bundle and what that will do is it'll, is it'll install all your Java classes as an OSGI bundle. And you have auto install package, which is going to install a content package to AM. And that's going to contain everything in UI content, UI apps, as well as the OSGI bundle. And then you have auto install package publish, which is just like auto install package, except it'll get deployed to a publisher. So I'll just run that really quick. Okay, now let's just double check to see that everything has been deployed. Okay, and here I see my training project and I have an English and a French page that I can just check out. And it looks like everything was successful. So we have successfully generated and built a AM archetype to our instance. Hope you enjoyed this tutorial.